flip it to win it. Mastering counter questions in English. Hello, language learners. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we'll dive into an exciting part of English conversation, formulating counter questions. Specifically, we'll learn about the intriguing concept of inverting the subject and the auxiliary verb in counter questions. So, without further ado, let's get started. Firstly, let's clarify what we mean by counter questions. In conversations, when you answer a question with another question, you're using a counter question. It's a brilliant tool to keep conversations flowing and to extract more information. For example, did you go to the concert last night? Why did you? Before we dive into the main topic, it's crucial to understand the usual placement of subject and auxiliary verb in questions. In English, questions often start with an auxiliary verb, do, have, can, etc., followed by the subject, and then the main verb. For example, do you like pizza? Have you seen this movie? Now, we're at the heart of our discussion, inverting the subject and the auxiliary verb. It's a fascinating feature of English, particularly useful in counter questions. Usually, we maintain the same order in our counter questions, like, did you go to the concert, did you? But sometimes, for emphasis or to express surprise, we flip or invert the subject and the auxiliary verb. You went to the concert, did I? Let's look at more examples to make this concept clearer. 1. You didn't tell him the truth. Did I not? 2. She can't swim, can't she? 3. They have left already, have they? Notice that we're using the same auxiliary verb from the original statement in our counter questions. We simply invert it with the subject to make a counter question. That's it for today, folks. Now you know a cool trick for creating counter questions, inverting the subject and the auxiliary verb. It might seem a bit tricky at first, but with practice, it will become second nature. So, keep practicing and add some spice to your English conversations. See you in our next video.